so guys welcome back so we are going to learn variables in C in detail in this lecture so let's define variable in C so what we are going to do we are going to learn definition of variable in C so what is variable variable is nothing but just a reference to a memory location what we do like if you want to perform some operation if you want to perform a calculation of two numbers sum of two numbers you need two things to apply your summation right you want to perform a sum so you need two things then only you can apply though those two things are known as variables in programming language in C suppose I want to multiply 3 into 4 so how will I write a C program for that so for that what I'll do I'll declare two variables a and b and then for a I'll assign 3 and for b I'll assign 4 and then I'll perform a into b and I'll get the result as a 12 so that is what C so for 3 and 4 we are giving some name that is known as naming a variable so let's see what is definition of a C variable so it's just a, like like I said earlier it's a memory location in computers memory to store data like 3 and 4 we are storing in A and B so those are just for memory allocation so we are now A and B A equal to 3 and B equal to 4 will be pointing to a memory location where value 3 and 4 will be stored so just for memory memory location in computers to store data and after storing data we can manipulate it's more of manipulation of data like I can store data without a name also but if I want to refer to that data I want a reference for that memory location where that value has been stored I need a name and that name is naming a variable so it's more of storing and manipulation of data so and with this we can manipulate the data so that's what we can give a name to a memory location and then we can use that variable to refer to that memory for manipulating that data and then it's just to indicate the memory location and each variable is given a unique name called identifier like we give a name like a b c d whatever okay or if you want to calculate a salary of a person you can give a like float salary or int salary so whatever that is a unique name we are giving in a program so this this is the definition of a variable in C let's see what variable declaration looks like in C so okay before that it's just a symbolic symbolic representation of memory location we have discussed it already so let's move on so example of variable in C so this is uh, look at this int number one so here I'm declaring a variable with a name number one and with the data type integer so here number one is a variable and int is a type of that variable so we will discuss the type of a variable or data type in C in the next section for now it is enough to know that this is the data type integer and this is number so we can define variables with particular naming convention that we discuss in the next lecture for now int number one this is a variable declaration you can declare with underscore 2 you can declare character variable like cat ch and you can declare a float monthly salary of a person so in this way we can declare a variable in c so see you in the next lecture where we will discuss about the naming convention for declaring a or writing a c variable